So I have been really bad about posting these videos and, you know, making the videos of this whole singer's musical theater anthology project that I said I was doing. Uh, the last video that I posted was December 15th of last year, so it's been almost a year. That's not okay, Martha. Because I kept making excuses, be like, well, I haven't gotten, you know, a new recording set up figured out yet, and blah, 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 and Martha, if you keep waiting for everything to be perfect, you'll never do anything. So, here I am recording a video in my definitely not perfect setup with my, you know, definitely not perfect hair or anything, or definitely not perfect songs, definitely not perfect voice, whatever. I'm doing it anyway. And I figured, what better song to start with, start back with, than uh, a song I've actually worked on in lessons before. It's been years, but, um, so it's not completely new. <laughs> and it is the song that first introduced me to the magic that is the one and only Kelly O'Hara, who I actually saw perform at the Dallas Summer Musicals like annual benefit thing, Night Fest of Broadway, uh, a couple days ago. And she was magnificent, as always. So I figured, anyway, Martha, stop babbling and actually sing the song. So here goes nothing. Bees are very popular in Italy. It's the land of naked marble boys. Something we don't see a lot in Winston-Salem. That's the land of corduroys. I'm just a someone in an old museum, far away from home as someone can go. And the beauty is I still meet people I know. Hello. This is wanting something. This is reaching for it. This is wishing that a moment would arrive. This is taking chances. This is almost touching what the beauty is. I don't understand a word they're saying. I'm as different here as different can be. But the beauty is I still need people like me. Everyone's a mother here in Italy. Everyone's a father or a son. I think if I had a child, I would take such care of her. Then I wouldn't feel like one. I've hardly met a single soul, but I am not alone. I feel known. This is wanting something. This is praying for it. This is holding breath and keeping fingers crossed. This is counting blessings. This is wondering when I'll see that boy again. I've got a feeling he's just a someone too. And the beauty is when you tribute to my other most recent vacation that I did when I went to the official Once Upon a Time convention in New Jersey for my birthday a couple weeks ago and I got this beautiful t-shirt. What's your story? So 
something to think about. Bye until next